Yeah, I was very intimidated by it. I, I felt like it was probably a big mistake because <laughs> I would be revealed to clearly not be as good as she is. Um, it, when you work with someone who just knows how to do it um, without seemingly very much thought, it's, it's a, an amazing thing to watch. Uh, and half the time I would kind of forget that I was even in the scene with her. Um, genuinely, she's amazing. Uh, she's one of our industry's best, I think. I mean, I read his book a lot. Uh, I would often try and steer the script back towards the book and kind of constantly read it while we were shooting and bring things back from the book that the writer had forgotten or didn't want to include and I would always try and push those things. I sat down with him for many, many, many hours and picked his brains, much to his exhaustion. Um, you know, you just hope you don't disappoint them, you know, because it's their, it's their life, it's their story, um, and that's the thing that's always kind of weighing on you, but I, I, I think he likes it. Last question real quick. Uh, according to IMDb, you're gearing up for your next film, uh, Donnybrook, a film about that revolves around bare-knuckle fighting. Uh, have you begun the physical training process, uh, and has it been difficult so far, or not yet? I can answer that question. His knuckles are, are basically bloody right now from the movie, so <laughs> he's covering them. <laughs> yeah, they were a lot worse last week. Um, yeah, I mean, it, fighting is a big aspect of the movie, but for me, that's kind of not the interesting part. Um, but we're having a good time, good time making it. Yeah.